Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you how to make arroz con gandules. Arroz con gandules is rice with green peas. Hispanics make this dish for a lot of weddings, get-togethers, parties, things like that. But me, like a Puerto Rican that I am, I make it on a Wednesday night just because I feel like having it. So if you like to know how to make arroz con gandules, please keep watching. And if you do like this video, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I make videos every Wednesday. So for this recipe, you're going to want to have rice, oil, olives, sofrito, garlic powder, onion powder, gandules, black pepper, tomato sauce, caldo de pollo, sazón, and chorizo. You can also add little chunks of ham if you like. So we're going to start with the oil. You can add as much as you like or as little as you like. Then you're going to put a packet of sazón. In a cube of the caldo de pollo. Next, you're going to put the garlic powder, onion powder, and now your black pepper. Then you're going to add your sofrito, and now you're going to add your olives. And this is the same thing as the oil. You can add as much as you want or as little. So for the water, you always want to put a half a cup more than what you're going to put for the rice. So I'm going to put two and a half cups of water and two cups of rice. So what I usually do is I put a little bit of water and then I put the heat to medium to high and I let all the ingredients that I just added to cook for just a little bit. Um, I don't know how to say in English, but in Spanish we say sofreír. I forgot to add this in the beginning, but if you like, you can also add a spoonful of tomato sauce. But this is just optional. You don't have to put the tomato sauce. So now I'm going to get the chorizo and I'm going to cut them into little pieces. With the chorizo, you have to make sure that you take out the little skin that comes in it. Are you going to see me? Um, yeah, that's, that's so gross. And you don't have to add chorizo. This is what I like to do. Um, my mom used to also add jamón, which is ham. So it's just your preference. Now you can add the chorizo or the jamón, whichever one you chose to use. And then you're going to want to mix it with the rest of the ingredients so it can cook just for a little bit before you add the water and the rice. Now you're going to add the gandules and then you're going to mix it with all the ingredients that you have in there. Now you can add the water and then you're going to put the temperature to high and let the water boil before you add the rice. And this is just a little trick that my mom taught me. You know that you put the exact amount of water and rice when you put a spoon in the middle and it stays. So what I usually do now is just 
I move the rice around ever so often so everything can be cooked all the way. And also make sure that you put the temperature on low heat. In my little stove, I always put it in around the number three. And one of the reasons why you want to put the temperature on low heat is because you don't want the rice to burn. That is also why I constantly move the rice around so I can make sure that it's not being burned and that everything is cooked thoroughly. And now your arroz con gandules is complete. You can pair this with chicken, pork chop, beef, uh, beef stew, chicken stew, whatever you prefer. It's always going to taste delicious. I hope that you guys liked my video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel because I love to cook for you guys. And if you do have suggestions, please let me know. Bye. Today I'm going to show you how to make arroz con gandules. Arroz con gandules. Every time I say arroz con gandules, he says something. Stop it. Arroz con gandules. Every time. Every time. Rice with not chickpea, green peas. Green peas. Green peas. Peas that are green. I'm trying to film something, sir. Exactly. I don't want fame, I just want love. I don't want fame, I just want trust. Why they all trying to knock me down? They should all know I'm hey, a stay up. Hey, everybody want to play me. Everybody want to change me. Nobody ever going to phase me. No fake accounts like KD.